Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> you woke up late. I did. What happened? Ah, I just had a crazy dream. Is that the potato dream again? <laughs> no, I like that dream. It's a good dream. Yeah. Yeah. You do love potatoes. I do. Is that what you're making? <laughs> no, it's a scrambled. Mm, your specialty. You know it. I do. No, it was just a. Uh, which is a strange dream. Like, you weren't there. Mm -hmm. I just remember feeling kind of lonely. Huh. Yeah. See, that's some good ones. She always are. In all my dreams. <laughs> Coffee? Ah, uh, yes, please. Be careful because it is hot. Oof. Hot like you? <laughs> <laughs> nah. You know what? You're hot. <laughs> Let me get my plate. So tell me more about this dream. Do you want to tell me about it? Uh, it was like, you know the hiking trail that we go to in Orange? It's like I'm there, and you know how we go to it all the time, so I know my way. So in the dream, it's like I don't know my way out. And I'm just stuck out there in the woods. And I just get this feeling of loneliness. It's like, I'm waiting for someone to guide me out of there. It was just a sad, strange dream. It felt like very real. You were not even there, you know? I remember feeling like I was lost and I couldn't find my way out. And you know how I know the hiking trail. So it was just like, it's just like I'm waiting for someone to guide me on my way out. And otherwise, I'd just be stuck there forever. Wait, where did you go? Private number. Juan Carlos speaking. Juan Carlos, it's Anna. Hi. I don't know anyone named Anna, how do you know my name? I'm the girl from your dreams. The ones you're having visions about. I do love your sexy voice, but I don't know what you're talking about. It's hard to explain. I'm all ears. I know everything about you. I know what you like, what you don't. I get you. You see, we, we belong together. Hmm. You gotta be the sexiest stalker I've ever spoken to in my life. You know that you're in a wrong time. You know that if you were in a different place, you'd be far more accomplished with your destiny. That's a uh, basic thought. I love your green eyes and the way you smile. Thank you. What do you look like? You know me. You've seen me. You have memories. 
of us that never happened. You see, we live parallel lives. Question is, are you in or out of time? I'm going insane. <sighs> and I'm tired of playing this game. You know what? I'm hanging up. No, no, no please, please. You have no idea what I've been through in order to get this opportunity to reach you. There is no time. The loop is closing. What do you mean? The year of Jubilee happens every 50 years. In which there's an opening in time where we can be together. You see, if we miss that window, we won't be able to be together. You won't be able to come into my time loop where you belong. First of all, like, how is that even possible? And just like, it's just, this is just too much for me to take. You need to trust me. Go to your balcony. You need to wait for the stars to align, and then you'll be teleported into my time loop. Am I going into the past, or, or I'm just gonna go into the future? I can't tell you this. If I will, it won't happen, okay? I can't fulfill my life without you, and you can't fulfill it without me. I don't know what to do. Take a leap of faith. Okay. I love you. I always have and always will. Everything I endured, I did it for you and it was worth it. And I'll do it all over again, I swear. My time is up. Wait, 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 please. No, I have to go. You have 30 seconds left. Goodbye. Ha <laughs> ha.